Hey guys, this is Kenneth from Kupo Sensor Techs. In this video, I'm going to explain the principle of our level sensors. As you can see, here are our level sensors, and we use the float as a tool for level detection. The float will go up and down with the liquid surface, but how does it send signal to the gauge or meter at the other side? Let us find out. In this section, I'm going to briefly introduce the re switch and how it is applied to a liquid level sensing solution. If you have already known the re switch and want to see an actual example, like a simulated fuel tank, you can skip to the next section and you will see our demo machine. Don't miss it because this demo machine is usually displayed in a trade show, but now you can see it right here. The structure of this switch is simple. It only contains two metal reeds and a glass chamber which is filled with inert gas or vacuum. A magnetic field will cause the reeds to come together and thus complete an electrical circuit. Therefore, a magnetic field is necessary to activate the re switch. So, how do we use re switch in level sensing solution? As you can see, here is our liquid level sensor. The re switches are welded on a PCB and sealed in the PCB tube. As I mentioned, we need a magnet to activate the re switch, so the magnet is sealed in the float. When the sensor is installed in the tank, the float will move up and down with the liquid surface. There is magnetic field around the float. When the float moves to a certain height, the referred re switch inside the sensor body will be activated. Once the re switch is activated, it will complete an electrical circuit and generate a signal. The signal will be sent to the gauge. The gauge will read the signal and indicate the current liquid level. Based on this technology, we have developed many different sensors. If you simply need a level sensing solution at somewhere, you may choose SFW series. The S series is designed for trucks and buses. There are many functions integrated on this sensor, such as fuel suction and return, fuel heater, air balancing vent, and so on. The SD series is designed for special vehicles. Similar to S series, it also integrated with fuel suction and the return pipe, air balancing vent, and the filter. The AdBlue sensor is designed for vehicles with SCR system. It will inject AdBlue liquid in exhaust system to decrease concentration of exhausted gas. Now I guess you've got the idea of the re switch and how it is applied to a liquid level sensing solution. If you need more information, please check the description below and click the address of our website. I think that's all for today. See you soon.